laser cutting has significantly improved the manufacturing process of steel components in production plants. They are extremely precise and very economical. Today we take a trip to Kimla, a Polish manufacturing company that has succeeded in conquering the market with their own laser cutting machine. Kimla decided to bring the international corporations which have already established their position in CO2 laser market down to size. They've taken advantage of the high demand for fiber laser cutting machines. The Polish company is a manufacturer of lasers using fiber technology which is much faster and cheaper in operation compared with CO2 technology. Almost all of the components of Kimler equipment are manufactured in the Chestakova based plant. Let's take a look at the production process. First, the designer prepares the technical drawing, taking into consideration all the requirements that the equipment has to meet in a given factory. The design is circulated to respective production departments. The main body is where the other components will be mounted. Heavy wall steel profiles used for production are delivered directly from the ironworks. Profiles achieve their length, shape, service and structural openings by utilizing a plasma profiling machine. Once cut, the pieces are sent through the shop blaster, ensuring the surfaces are clean and smooth prior to moving on to the fabrication department. Profiles are fixed onto the welding panel. Welded and once finished, the joints are cleaned. The machine frame is now subject to high precision machining, utilizing a multiple axis milling machine, enabling Kimler to produce extremely large machines. The frame is positioned on the machine bed, so all critical mounting faces can be machined in one. This allows the frame to be machined to micrometer accuracy. After machining is completed, the frame is transported to the paint shop, where it receives an aesthetic and protective coating. The subsequent workstations manufacture and provide the remaining components of the machine. One machine may consist of several hundred components. The laser covers are processed on one of Kimler's very own fiber lasers. Prior to being sent onto the bending department. Once bent panels are dipped to remove any grease or other contaminants so a perfect powder finish can be achieved. These powder coatings offer maximum protection and durability. Aluminium components are cut by the water jet. Machines manufactured by Kimler are dynamic, so it is critical weight is kept to a minimum, so most of the components are made of various aluminium alloys. The laser's velocity reaches 5 meters per second with an acceleration of 6G. All machined components are subject to detailed drawing and preparation. The technicians ensure the toolpath is optimized, utilizing state-of-the-art machining centers. Accuracy is critical, so machining is undertaken in one operation, using five axis machining centers. Where high precision is critical, Kimler undertake extremely precise measurement checks. This is particularly useful when development components are developed. As mentioned before, lasers are completely produced in the Chestakova based plant. This includes Kimler's own linear motors used to position each axis. The linear systems offer a high power density, reducing space required for the overall machine. Let's see how the entire device is assembled. The body is transported from the paint shop to the assembly hall. Appropriate parts are collected from the depot. Inner casings and duct vents are mounted. These allow smoke and dust to be evacuated from the machine area and discharged once cleaned by the filter system. 
the drive chain, which is responsible for the pallet movement, is mounted. Next is the installation of the linear motors. Magnets are covered under the bellows, which also provide cover for the measuring system. At the same time, the control cabinet is mounted, equipped with automation components and Kimler's very own PLC, produced in the electrics department. The entire mounting is done step by step at the respective workstations on a systematic automated assembly line, similar to automotive companies. Finally, the device casing is made and the control cabinet mounted. The laser is equipped with software supplied by Kimler IT developers, specifically designed to optimize the fiber lasers. Once completed, the machine is configured and tuned. Parameters are tested and the whole machine is put through a strict test program. After the operation is carefully tested to the producer's satisfaction, the device can be delivered to the client. In addition to lasers, Kimler also manufacture a range of other machines and equipment. These include milling machines, ranging from small, used for engraving or the production of dentures, to large, multiple axis devices, capable of processing various materials, such as cardboard, timber, gum, plastics, non-ferrous metals or textiles. Here you can purchase tools and parts that become wear and tear during the life cycle of the machine. Lasers are often equipped with many additional options. In factories both in Poland and abroad, approximately several hundred lasers are in operation, produced by Kimler.